These are so soft. Like, oh my god. I just am in love with this carryout. Have a look. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is Ayn's first time. Hello, everyone. So today I am going to go through every single piece of clothing that I own. So if you've been around here for a while, you know we're pretty into minimalism. We literally live in a van, so it's kind of got to be that way. And over the past, I don't know, five or so months, I've accumulated like a bit of clothing. So this is a lot for me. I've got this container, this container, and this overflowing container here. So that's all of my clothing and I wasn't sure how to film this if you guys would be interested in me showing you literally how I go through everything or if you just wanted to see the end result of what I keep but I did a little poll here on YouTube and you guys wanted to see the whole process so I'm gonna go through my stuff today and I'm probably gonna get rid of quite a bit I'll donate most of it and then I'll keep a few things for my sisters or friends and then I'll keep the rest of it so I have like a really small space where I can fit my clothing and at the moment it's so hard to get stuff in there it's constantly messy because I've got too much stuff and if you follow me on like Instagram or here you'll notice that like I've been wearing a few new clothes recently um, because for quite a while I was wearing the same stuff over and over and over again and I've had a few new pieces um, come my way and I'm just ready to let go of some old stuff. So usually I just do it by going through each piece individually and putting it into a pile and I usually have four piles, stuff I'm definitely keeping, stuff I'm not sure about, stuff I'm donating and stuff I'm giving to friends or family. There is no order to these drawers at the moment, it's just a bit of a don't really know where to start. <laughs> In other videos I've spoken about minimalism and clothing and how beneficial it is I think to downsize so if you want to check out those videos I talk a bit more about that and in this one I'm just kind of going to go through stuff if you want to go through your stuff whilst you watch that would be awesome but so therapeutic to get rid of your things and just keep it simple so let's start with my casual clothes these are my new denim shorts that I've been wearing quite a bit definitely keeping them I like just like really simple high-waisted denim shorts shorts these are from a brand jeans um so i'll be keeping those and this is my long sleeve top that i've had for like maybe four or five years i still wear it a lot and i'll be keeping that this is just like a plain khaki top which i don't wear very much i'll be donating that donate piles going over here i haven't worn these for months they're going donate these are my overalls that so many of you have asked where they're from. I am loving them. Super comfy, simple. They are from a company called Assembly Label in Australia. They do very like minimalist style clothing. So I'm keeping those. T-shirt from Golden Brown, the label. It says power to the peaceful. I love this new shirt. It's all ethically made in Byron Bay. So I'll be keeping this one. And then I got this in Bali. I still wear this a little bit. It's nearly time to let go of it because I just don't wear it enough, but I'll keep it for now. What top is it? Oh, this is a top my sister lent me because I didn't have a top the other month. It is definitely going to Vinnie's. This skirt, I've worn it a bit, but it's going because I don't wear it enough. You would have seen this in other videos. This is a opia dress it's like a linen sort of dress they're so pretty but i just don't wear this basically at all but i'm going to give this to um i think one of my friends or if my sister was one of my sister wants it but um this was a gift from chris i love it i just don't wear it and um i think someone else would wear it more so i'm going to keep another pile going on behind me for friend stuff these are my sister's pants so i would donate them but um, I'll give them back to her. This is like a crochet top. I didn't actually make this one um, And I don't really wear it much. I am going to donate it This is just like a plain top I am getting rid of because I don't wear it enough and I don't need it these Yoga tights they are from Dharma bums an ethically made yoga company in Australia These were given to me by a girlfriend. I really like them I think I'll give them to a friend who said they also liked them 
so I'll give them away. All right, guys, these flare pants, have, it's been years and years and years and years, and they're so thin, it's ridiculous. Like, I don't know if you can see that, but these are very thin. They've been with me a while. They've nearly got holes in them, they're so thin, and I'm gonna get rid of them today. <sighs> I love them. I would buy these in a heartbeat again. Um, they're from Arnhem Clothing, who have just released an eco line, actually. So maybe they'll release some new ones because, oh my gosh, I love them. Actually, I, I'm actually going to put them into the not sure pile. They're in a not sure pile because they're just my faves. This is a long sleeve top my mum gave me when I got back to Australia. It was warm. Um, it's just a bit out of shape. It is going donate. I don't know if you guys have probably seen this dress. I got it over Christmas from like a little dress store. It is so short looking. Like I, it's actually a dress. And I really just, it's just like for over bikinis and stuff. So I'll keep that because I just love like super light weight fabric just to wear in summer. Uh, these overalls, so many of you asked where I got them from. They're new. They just go over a bikini and I really love them. They are from a surf store where Chris's parents live and they're billabong. So I'll be keeping them. This is a new skirt, a hand-me-down from my sister from Arnhem Clothing. I just like to wear it with like that little white top or the top I've got on and it's just a bit more like pretty. So I'll definitely keep that one. This is my other OPR dress the ones from byron bay ethically made and i love it it's so pretty once again i just don't think i'm wearing it enough but i'm gonna put this one into the maybe pile just because i really love it and it was a gift from chris oh no i'm gonna keep it actually that is sort of my casual clothing so i'm gonna put this in a container i actually Roll, uh, roll all my clothes that's that white top so I have to refold them all re-roll them all so they fit in better but that's like most of my casual clothing and now I'm going to go through my like yoga sort of clothing these I'm gonna get rid of they are from a company called Niamasol I love them they're just yoga shorts made out of recycled plastic bottles I've got a couple of pairs and I don't wear these are the ones I wear the least so I'm going to gift them to someone they've been amazing I'll leave their link to their store in the description box made out of recycled plastic bottles like so awesome and same with these these are the tiki ones i've had these for quite a while now worn them so much i'm going to keep them but yeah also made out of recycled plastic bottles then the other two pairs of yoga shorts i've still got are these tiki ones which i'll keep and then also another pair of niyama sole ones which um, i'll also keep with the succulents on them so they're just like super easy, especially in the van. They take up no room and I can just hand wash them. So I'll keep all of those. <laughs> These shorts, I've had them for maybe like, I don't know, six years. I run in them. I'm so ready to let these go, but they're great running shorts. So I'll keep them for now. And same with these, I just wear these as like uh, pajamas sort of. So I'll keep those as well. These are like from my sister. They're like pajama bottoms, so they're going. Now, let me get some new tops out, which I am loving. These are from Indigo Luna, an ethically made clothing company uh, based in Australia, made in Indonesia. These are all plant dyed. Like they, it's a vegan company, and like this top here is dyed using mango leaves, and it takes two weeks. The coolest thing about this company is that for one, it's all environmentally friendly, ethically made clothing. But what happens in the dyeing process that takes two weeks, afterwards, all of the um, runoff gets put onto garden beds. So there's no like chemical wastage or anything. It's just a complete cycle. And I really love that. So these are organic. Uh, I think this one's the organic cotton one. And they're just so soft and comfortable. So these are my new yoga tops. I've got this one. I've got this one made out of indigo leaves, all naturally dyed, no chemicals, organic cotton. These are so soft. Like, oh my goodness, they're so soft. I love 
love, love, love these singlets. And I really, really love naturally dyed clothing. It's just always got those earthy tones. And I don't know, I just really like the colors that come from that. This is another Indigo Luna top. This one is their organic bamboo, which is a bit, little bit thicker and just so soft and nice on the skin. This is a bit stretchy. This one I usually like wear like this and tie this front part in a little knot there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. Do you need Aya's helmet? Yeah. Aya, you're on a bike. You wave? I Hello. <laughs> Do you want me to get your helmet? Have you got your slippers on? <laughs> All right. One second. I'm just gonna grab Aya's helmet. All right. Okay. There you go. This is Aya's first time on a bike, and they just Chris just hired this bike because they wanted to do something whilst I filmed. Can we see Aya with the helmet on? Ready. You ready for a bike ride, Aya? Yeah. Uh, look up. Uh, show mummy. Yay! <laughs> you be safe. Alright, let's go. Love you guys. Love you too. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, so cute. <laughs> okay. Alright, so yeah, they're my new yoga tops. These are all from Indigo Luna, just an amazing company. They are um, all made out of things like organic bamboo, organic cotton, recycled fishing nets, and yeah, such an awesome, awesome company that I'm loving. These are also organic plant dyed gypsy sort of pants that I got before I was pregnant with Ayana. I'm parting ways with these i love these so much i got them in bali it's an ethically made company yeah they've just been worn a lot and they're sort of they're ready to go they've lost a lot of their shape so they'll be going these are some new tights made out of recycled fishnets from indigo luna and i love this color so i'm keeping them obviously and then this top is just yeah, we got to talk about this. This top is just my favorite top at the moment. I will have this forever. It's just a really big, loose top. Great for traveling. It's made out of organic bamboo. It's dyed with almonds. But look at this. This is oil that got on it the other day. If you guys know how to get oil out of clothes, please, please tell me. Like, I'm sure I can save this because it's honestly just such a beautiful top to wear. It's Indigo Luna. I'm in love with this top. Like, ugh. I love those, like, looser fitting tops. But, yeah, this is a real, obviously, issue. But, yeah, can you please let me know if you know how to get oil out of clothing? I feel like because I'm a mom, I should know this sort of stuff, but I don't. <laughs> These pants, so many of you have asked where they're from. Here, I've worn them in a few videos. I got them when we were in Griffith. I didn't have pants at the time. They are not ethically made. They're from cotton on. I don't recommend buying them at all. They're just not very good quality. And any sort of mark the fabric shows every mark like you get water on these and it goes really dark and they just mark terribly i'm keeping them at the moment just because you know like they're comfy and i've got them but i'll part ways with them soon i don't really rate them because of the marking issue these are another pair of pants that were given to me by my mum they are dharma bums that ethically made australian yoga company i'm going to give them back to her just because i've got other tights at the moment these are from a company called Yogi Peace Club. I met the lady who owns this company, Emma, not too long ago. And I love these tights, these khaki ones. They don't really move when I wear them. And they've got this little drawstring here so I can make them um, tighter, which I love because I really don't like pulling up tights constantly when I'm wearing them. Um, so yeah, I like these tights from her. And she also actually gifted me these tights, which are way different to the other ones, and they fit really well. But as you can see, I haven't actually worn these ones yet. So my yoga tight situation is I've got 
one, two, three, four pairs of yoga tights at the moment and three yoga shorts, a pair of running shorts and then like my new yoga tops. That is everything in that container, my yoga haul. So we're getting there. We've got these two containers of clothes now, which will fold, roll down really nicely and fit in here really well. And then I have the swimwear and like crops container. So I think in my last video, I would have had one bikini for ages. I just had one bikini and now I've definitely got more and I really like it because I seriously live in my bikini. We're always at the beach. And it's just nice to have a couple of bikinis. So yeah, let's do this. Some of them I'm gonna get rid of today. So I've posted a couple of Instagram photos in this one piece. It is made out of recycled fishnets. It's so beautiful. I love it. It's got a low back. This is from Indigo Luna. So I've got this one piece and also this blue one piece this is like a beautiful blue color and the same style at the back from indigo luna so i've got those two one pieces and this is like the first time i've had one pieces seriously so good this bikini is from rhythm it was my secret santa gift this year so it's this maroon top these rhythm bottoms really loving it pretty sure this is not ethically made all my other bikinis at the moment are nearly all from indigo luna first off though i'll show you this bikini is very little it is from coco bikinis the beautiful kendall owns coco bikinis all ethically made as well and just she's so amazing she designs all her own prints and everything i would wear this all of the time except the bottoms are too small for, for me in size like that i need a larger size these are like a six and i definitely need the eight or the ten and then i have this is a gift actually for my sister that's why it's got the tag on it i've got these two crops from um, indigo luna this is the box crop these are made out of organic bamboo they're super soft ethically made these are my yoga crops here then i've got I'm missing some stuff Okay, I just realized I was missing a few things, so I just grabbed them from the box that that camera was sitting on. Okay. Wow, I just realized I've had this greens on my face that whole video. Anyway. <laughs> So I just found a couple more things that I realized I forgot to get out and one of those things was this t-shirt from In The Soul Shine says vegan vibes. I so 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 rate this top. I love it because obviously I love the message but it's just so well made. It's super software, ethically made and I was fortunate enough to be gifted this top from Tanya. Um, who owns In The Soul Shine because I randomly met her and her sister one day at um, a creek in Jarvis Bay. They were there with their van and we got chatting and they're just such, such beautiful people. And yeah, I really treasure this top um, and definitely, definitely rate this top in terms of quality. Uh, and I'll link their store below. If you ever wanted to get a vegan top then yeah i i think they're the best ones i haven't owned really many but they're awesome <laughs> so that goes in my casual clothes now i have here these underwear set by hara the label this is all ethically made um naturally dyed what happened with this coloring here is that chris accidentally put them in the washing machine with a heap of other white stuff the colors run a bit i still really love like the earthy tone this is so comfortable guys like this isn't my most favorite ever sort of like bralette style top i love them there's different colors it's just they're so comfy um like i said the colors run out of these a lot but i still really like them like this and i think i'll probably get another set i just they're so amazing this is hara the label 
another yoga swimwear top. This is from Bear and Boho. Once again, ethically made, beautiful, beautiful vegan company. And I just love the print on this top. I'll link them in the description box. This is like Mums and Bubs organic stuff. Then I've got this green indigo luna bikini this was the only bikini i had for quite a while it's just like a simple bralette style top and yeah i love this style top because it just doesn't move too much and these bottoms by them are a cut i really like because they're not like super super skimpy but they're not like full coverage they're sort of in between and i've got them in also in like this mangoey color that i haven't worn yet because i only just got them exactly the same these are all made out of recycled fishnets and then indigo luna i've also got these olive colored ones these bottoms here that go with this top which I sort of tie like that it's a bit skimpier this top but I really like it super comfy and I've got one more bikini by indigo luna at the moment and it's this like basic triangle sort of tie up top and I've been wearing that quite a lot with this these bottoms they're sort of a bit more like higher up on the sides a bit more like old school style really really like them too because they cover up the tattoo that I've got on my hip perfectly and I don't really like that tattoo guys so loving these and then I've just like discovered I've still got these bikini bottoms that I had when I was in like Bali and Thailand last year they were the only bikinis I had there yeah I'm going to donate these or let them go because I don't need them anymore so that is my bikinis I'll put all of those back in here so yeah guys we're nearly there cool so I have here like some bikini yoga stuff the casual clothing and then the more like yoga style clothing this is stuff that I'm going to get rid of this is stuff I'm gifting to friends or family and then hmm, my all right I'm not getting rid of them yet maybe I'll wear them one one more time I'm not ready to part ways with them oh and I've got obviously the clothes I've got on is this little black singlet which is I think billabong and these pants let me try to show you I've got these pants which are like organic bamboo cotton they've got a high waist that you fold down they're awesome awesome yoga pants and they're from indigo luna the other thing I wanted to show you was my new carrier or Aya's new carrier it's linen it's all completely ethically made have a look it's so beautiful this is replacing the ergo baby i just am in love with this carrier it's so soft i really rate the ergo baby as well but this is just more pretty i suppose it's called zapa baby baby <laughs> it is all just ethically made organic this is linen and these were handmade by a lady at the sunshine coast in australia they're now getting made in indonesia by um women there and just everything about this company is amazing this is would be the most incredible gift for a pregnant mom just this beautiful beautiful carrier and i will probably gift friends who are pregnant with this carrier just because it's so lovely so i'll put the link in the description box for this as well i'm going to roll this up all of these clothes so you can see what it's like all packed up how much room it takes up but yeah i'll show you exactly what i end up having another great thing to do with clothing that you don't want or need any longer is to sell it in the past i have used ebay and gumtree in australia with the money that you make from the clothing you can put it towards something that actually brings more value into your life and that might be pursuing something that you are passionate about online i just want to take a moment now to thank squarespace for sponsoring this video squarespace is an online platform where you can design your own website there's beautiful templates so many different designs that can reflect 
your personality and your passion and purpose so make sure to check them out and who knows you could sell a few pieces of clothing and fund your website for the next year I'm really start pursuing goals online so thank you again Squarespace and if you want 10% off your first purchase you can head over to www.squarespace.com forward slash Jinty so yeah check them out and I am going to put these clothes away okay guys this is it so I've got one on top here then this has one drawer behind it and this one in front and then Chris and Aya's clothes are over here but that's our clothing space so I hope you enjoyed this new wardrobe update I have lots of different clothing than the last video and if you want more information about how I sort clothing or my thoughts about all of this sort of stuff I've made yeah plenty of other videos which I'll share the links to thank you so much for watching let me know how you go downsizing your clothes I've had lots of you write to me saying that you've gone through a lot of your clothing and it's honestly it's so therapeutic and it frees up a lot of time and energy that we you know put into deciding what to wear and thinking about buying clothes and scrolling the internet online looking at clothes and comparing ourselves minimalism in the wardrobe is such a time and energy saver uh, and also a money saver sometimes so i hope you enjoyed watching if you like these style videos make sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know and i can keep you updated if you want to see like aya's clothes or anything um let me know <laughs> but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in the next video bye